All right. It is here. We are in the playoffs. Let me get adjusted here. And if anyone is watching this in a timely fashion, Merry Christmas Eve to you and yours. We are in the 1991 NFL season, and it is the playoffs. We are the Steelers. We have a first-round bye here, and we'll play the winner of the Raiders versus the Chiefs. Oilers and Bills are going to face off. Fortunately, one of those teams will be knocked out, but then the winner of that will go on to face the Dolphins. We'll see Saints, Falcons, Vikings, Packers today as well, prior to our game. So in the playoffs, it's a little bit different. There is no more auto-skip. We are going to see a nice summary right here. We'll see any injuries as they occur. Oilers taking on the Bills, and wow, Buffalo there. Going to win this one, 34-28, and looking at the back of the stream, yeah, Buffalo is a big second half to pull ahead there. Looks like the Oilers couldn't really get a, a running game going. Moon's one interception, maybe that's the difference. Kelly was perfect on the day in that regard. Thurman Thomas, pro bowler stopped, only 56 yards. And I wonder, does that actually... Does that count for his rushing total? No, it does not. So he stays just below that 2,000 mark. Alright, so one down. The Bills are going to advance to play the Dolphins. Unfortunately for us, we still got the Bills in the picture. Saints and the Falcons and NFC West. Winner here takes on Big Brother, the San Francisco 49ers. And rooting on the Saints. Yeah, just because they surprised me so much last time, I think I've just really been underestimating them. And that might just be due to like my history watching the New Orleans Saints as a kid. They're always the one of the worst teams, I, th I thought. But I guess in 93 they're expected to be good, or maybe they were good. Hilliard's really the big deal here. Chris Miller is a pro bowler, but he's not, and so is Andre Risen, but they're not able to get enough going on to win this game. So the second AFC divisional playoff game. We're on to this. We'll face one of these two teams, the Raiders versus the Chiefs. And no surprise there that we will be taking on the Chiefs. They ran the ball. They actually passed the ball effectively too with QB Chiefs. He did not have an incompletion, whereas Hostetler had 19%. Keeping in mind, we were considering Hostetler for the Pro Bowl. Um, really terrible performance for him. He completed one pass. Koye leads in rushing, but Word leads in receiving. Both very good running backs. Okay, so now we get that second NFC wild card game. This will be the Vikings versus the Packers. The winner's going to face the Cowboys in Dallas. Uh-oh. So Terry Allen is hurt. We now have a bruised Minnesota squad. Yeah, and they will not hang on to win this game. Terry Allen was having a heck of a game before he got hurt there. Ends up being the leading rusher in the game. Sharp on the reverse is the leading rusher for Green Bay. Okay, so next one we'll see here should be the Dolphins versus the Bills. I think we'll take 49ers versus the Saints, and then it is our turn. So let's see what happens here in this next divisional game. And probably rooting for the Dolphins here. Uh, so it is. Game loves the Bills. In the words of, I think, Leonardo was his name. There's a great Tecmo Super Bowl website back in the day. Actually built the NES one. Uh -oh. 
But it, the same is true of the Super Nintendo version. The game loves the Bills. So you would expect San Francisco to be able to win this one pretty handily, even though, of course, the Saints were neck and neck with them this year. Yeah, they'll pull away here. So not a lot of surprises in this playoff. Um, San Francisco is going to advance against the Saints, and it's our turn. Thought about changing up the playbook. Thought about trying to add some new wrinkles and catch them off guard, but I think we are who we are, and we're going to get our chance to do that against the two-headed monster that is Barry Ward, that is Christian Okoye. We'll start with the ball. See if Woodson can get us in a good situation just to start it off. Pro Bowler Nick Lowry. Get that playoff music. A lot of desperation. And those chords. Okay, and we're rusty. It's been a week since we've played football, and actually it's been a couple days since I've played Tecmo at all. So, appropriate bye week situation here but we want to get the ball out to foster the stone on the edges we want to get out of bounds we want to limit turnovers limit negative plays see if he can complete it Oh, it's going to be a tough task winning one of these with O'Donnell. It just is. And we're keeping the ball on the, in the air. That was dumb. Should have gone out of bounds. First down. Blue 48. So I feel like when the ball's in the air, there's more options for how to move down the field. And actually, really impressive scramble from O'Donnell there. We'll uh, just get the first down here if we can. We'll stop. We cannot. So you just block on that middle real fast. We're actually going to keep to the air here. And hopefully we can get an open swing pass. Nothing to do there. So very long drive. And we'll get a chance for three points at the end of that. All right. Actually just hit me that uh, the actual NFL playoffs that year featured the Steelers and the Chiefs. I think in the wild card run, and I think the Chiefs won in overtime. And the reason I feel pretty sure about this is I think it was my birthday party. Okay, we're going to try a to block a Koye and off tackle, but I don't know this playbook very well. This is a tough, tough situation. We may need to defend against the pass, but oh, Koye is so good, and Barry Word is certainly no slouch that it's going to just be a very difficult job stopping offense. I guard against the pass that time. Looks like I was still able to handle the play I was actually most worried about, which was at Okoye North. So something to think about here as the game progresses and I get more comfortable with what their plays look like. Really. And that catch was cash. So that time I wasn't able to do anything against it, so. Touchdown. So 
So this is going to be a real challenge. Oh, it would have been nice. Woodson got off the edge well there, just... Nicolari did not waste time. Alright, good field position. Just thinking about if O'Donnell could have connected with Jeff Graham on that. And then overthrow, he dove for different scenario here, but this is where we are. That's just fine on first day. Really? I didn't have time to hit B. Neil Smith. Yeah, he will do that to you. Let's give ourselves some more time. I think we gotta. I don't think we've shown we can stop this team. Come on. First down. Just big jumping catch by Jeff Grant. That was another overthrow waiting to happen on fourth down long. Whew. Truthfully, I just didn't like our odds of, I had thought if we cannot score a touchdown here, if we cannot score here, I don't think we can win this game. First down. Just, just wanted to get in there somehow. Probably should have gotten out of bounds, but first down at the one. Figured they'd be expecting pass there. Bootleg out with O'Donnell. We're annoyed. Time wise, unfortunately, that's plenty for them. If we can keep them slowed down, maybe, but. And they're getting a the ball back at the half, so. Clockwise, not working out to our early favor. And I barely know what to call here. Oh, and they've been so effective. Doing a Koi off tackle that they bring on for the touchdown. Really? First down. He just just got across then. Round fifty-two. Either play action or out in the middle. Got lucky there, I think. Could be Quay off tackle, could be the word run low or a pass. First down. And they're gonna have plenty of rushing yards on me. Which I think we knew going into the game, but I wasn't sure I expected as many of them to be on scrambles. So I'm going with green there. Really. Double covered. All right, that's gonna put him to field goal range. That's for sure. Oh wow. Um, let's see if we can get there. Nope. Let's see if he missed it. Yes. Oh good. Whoo. All right, let's try the Jeff Graham bomb. It's gonna be like. Quintuple covered here. 
let's see. Uh, I was hoping for a miracle. Right on the money, though. Alright, so we do go up 10 7 into the half. The Chiefs are going to get the ball back. Um, it's a very difficult game so far. Um, take it, we can get through the air. We're just having a lot of trouble even slowing these guys down, though. I did not expect any touchback there. I thought that was probably pretty good placement. Keep guarding that Okoye, run Great north, hut, hut, go here, hut, stop any hut, southern hut. runs. Okay. I was able to avoid contact there and uh, make sure I was able to stick him. I think this is pass. Gotta get out of bounds, QB Chiefs. Alright, big momentum shift. No. Oh, that was a bad decision. I was actually going for one of the guys in the flats and just couldn't hit A enough times. Try this play again. Whew. That's a big, big swing. So we've got to keep putting ourselves in position to where we're winning the turnover battle. We can win this game if we get more possessions, that's for sure. Jeff Graham on that fourth Blue, down play. Blue, hut, hut, Might hut, have saved hut, the season. Hut. We're still guarding against the Okoye run north, but seemingly Blue, having some good hut, against hut, hut, the hut, dive play with that. Alright, here's the pass. Hut, hut, He ran up. I went to meet him. And that's worse. And uh, he threw First it over my head. Blue, hut, hut, Same play. Hut, I'm staying hut. back this time. Never mind. I didn't realize that was actually a possible play call. sure if they had a passing play out of that formation. All right. Huge play. Get him to third one. Cornell Lake will get the break up there, and they've got to kick the field goal. Okay, seven point game, one score game here. And we've got to take some time off the clock. We've got to get a touchdown here. I guess a field goal with enough time would be fine. Yeah, see if he gets there. If we're going to make that throw to Graham. We're going to have to do it quick. Red 24. Red 24. Hut. Really, Neil. Overshoots him. 
delivers the ball out of bounds. Uh, this is not what we were hoping for. Oh. That's a lot of green there. Had to get rid of that one. And that's going to be a good punt. Take us to the fourth quarter. Keep uh, guarding against the net play. Ready, set, put, 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 put. All right, some luck there. I think now we we're gonna call a pass play. Might have been that one. Oh, double no. Kind of, of course, they catch that, but very big stand from our defense here. Had to finally had to force a punt at some point. Did I get there? Not quite. <laughs> I was pretty much trying out of bounds there. Right, 3.40. Come on. First Ernie down. Mills with the first downfield catch of his day. I was hoping to bleed the clock, but if I've got a guy open, I think it's safe. I'm going to hit him. In the, in the ground there, basically. Effectively. We're going to actually try to run middle of stone. See if... No, okay. Not what I wanted here, but we'll go up two scores. The onside kick does become a threat at this point in the season, of course. Um... So, kind of got to make them earn it. Okay. Red 24. Red 24. Put, put, put. Good. Red 32. Get back there and hope you can cover somebody. First down. Red 24. Put, put, put. Blue 43. Thank you. All right, no running out of chances here. Round 52. Kevin Green, furious as Pro Bowl snub. It's fourth and 20. We'll guard against the pass here. Blue 43. Blue 43. Nailed it. We're going to go with the shotgun pass here to take up as much time as possible in a single play. Game.
Okay, it wasn't easy. Um, really just the turning point, the difference here is uh, what they weren't able to do with that missed field goal at the end of the half, and uh, that they had to turn over and we didn't. That's the difference. Definitely holding Okoye in word the very few rushing yards Okoye did to get a big touchdown run on one is big as well. Um, so, escaping that one it feels like. But of course we got the Bills waiting for us next. Meanwhile in the NFC, Packers and the Cowboys and kind of expect Dallas to run away with this one. Oh, why has it got to be the Bills? Yeah, and Dallas has been looking absurd this off this uh, playoff season. We're now at a point here where there are four teams remaining. The Bills, the Niners, the Cowboys, and the Steelers. One team I wouldn't want to face is the Bills, but these are actually the three teams I would like to play against least <laughs> in this entire game. There's no Philadelphia Eagles here. There's no uh, New Orleans Saints. There's just pain. This is a season that unfortunately uh, regressed to the mean hard. We got all the best teams in here with us. It started off so promising, looking like it might be a chaotic one. Okay, second verse, Sam is the first. We know our game plan here. We might have to execute a little bit quicker than usual because of Bruce Smith. First down. Who, as you can see, is suddenly the fastest human being on the entire planet. Both guys open there. Maybe. First down. Okay. Pretty good when you pick your play and you're able to get one completed like that. I mean, obviously, that's a large element of luck. I'm not here to take credit for it. Oh, she was thrown at the mills. Looks like I had him open on the replay. Come on. Oh. If you could just get a few more of those on target. We are Steve Young away from being 16 and over. One extra A button press I should not have done there. I think... If I get that to green, it's a big, big play. Get on the board first. Definitely took some time there. Definitely will have to make them work for it. Okay, so we played them before. We like to do the Davis play at the middle and then guard against Thurman Thomas down low whenever they're in the T formation. We can usually turn that into some turnovers. Okay, okay. Oh no. It's taking some bounces I do not like. Now it's taking bounces I love. Woohoo! 
That play will take a couple years off your life. That's massive. First, it's bouncing toward a Bills player, and there's the Steelers guys falling all around, and I'm thinking, they picked this up. They're going for six. They're going far, anyway. Um, and then it starts bouncing backward. Suddenly, there's a cloud of black and gold around it. And, uh, yeah, we'll... we'll oh! We'll take that. What is happening here? Carnell, like, picks up both of those. And just a little bit of pressure here. Don't screw this up. <laughs> and I'm gift wrapped. A three score lead on the Bills in the first quarter. That's enough time for Buffalo. But that's this is the best uh, start you could hope for. Absolutely, aside from scoring a touchdown in the first drive. So if we can go three in a row, no. Okay. Same strategy. We're going to try for turnovers in this game. You want to see that Thurman Thomas play. When we don't, we'll play back. Red, 24. This could be the run though, so I'll have to stay up. It's not. Okay. Nope, nope. Well, I'm throwing over you. So that's fine. We're already in a point in the game where, like, if they want to take an extra play to do something, we can let them. It would have been nice to turn that into a turnover, but, you know, can't be that greedy here. We've gotten enough luck. <laughs> oh! They are going to give it to me. And Rod Woodson finally gets a punt return for a touchdown, in a sense. Popcorn some guys off to do it, and just unreal. Unreal that this is happening against the Bills. This is the buffalo we're used to seeing. Jim Kelly slaps his helmet on and trots off onto the field. What? <laughs> Seems like they benefited from a glitch there. Like this is also what you expect the Bills to see. Them just get this like bizarre glitch in their favor. Yeah, Andre Reid cover, catching covered balls. This is the game I expected to have from this point onward, I guess. And I misplayed that. Now it's my fault. Should have stayed back. It's like, now if they throw it to Andre Reid, it doesn't really matter if it's covered or not. You really, but so I should have done. It didn't take him much time at all. the A button there to, in case anyone touched me, but couldn't quite get all the way. Still, it's a big return, especially for this late in the year. Come on. First down. I'm going to stick with that play. We've got an answer here. Come on. Oh.
I mean, I'm in disbelief here. A couple long touchdown passes to Jeff Graham in the playoffs is stupidly unlikely. See if it's a run. It is. Let's engage with them. That's fine. He'll run seven to get three. Red twenty-four. Put. 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 Glad it's who you picked, Jim. It's funny that like I know exactly how to play against like the Bills playbook because you're always going up against the Bills in the playoffs. This is just like what I'm used to. Oh, first down. Yeah, well covered, Thurman Thomas. But you're up against the Bills in the playoffs and the Cowboys in the playoffs. If we see him next week, aren't much different. Jerry Rice is actually worse. He's harder. So. Bills are electing for the field goal here. They do start with the ball in the second half. And Steve Christie pulls a Scott Norwood. And you know our ML here at the end of the half. Just take the sack. I think I'll have enough time for one more shot at it here. Red 24. Put. Put. Really? So they guess it twice and uh, we go into the half up four scores. Not the game you expect to have against the Bills. You don't expect to see them make this many mistakes. You do expect them to catch every contested ball. You expect you to be the one fumbling every play, two plays in a row. So I'll gladly take that bad luck against Houston for this good luck now. What were you doing all the way back there? <sighs> really? He's like falling down as soon as I touch him, so I'm not able to lock him up and go for the turnover. Let's all be real, it's kind of cheese anyway, so... Gerald Williams gets there. Every play we make against Buffalo is a good one. Good one. Score here, or even a long drive, is effectively ball game. Down on first down out of Foster. 
Stone to stop a second earlier. He started running there. I didn't throw it initially because he was at first covered. That guy backed off as he does. He's gonna do that again. Just in time. Third and four. It's makeable. Especially if you have Foster space. <laughs> Alright, now's a that was a mistake, I guess. I think I was expecting him to lead Ernie Mills and he's under through him by a mile. Neil Donald and it's almost the fourth quarter in the playoffs. Gotta be smarter. Gotta realize he can do that and if it's not perfect, you need to tuck it and run there. Here's the bomb. Reed's uncovered, oh no. Okay. He probably made it, but that's fine. Just can't do quick touchdowns and two point conversions. Or two point versions, onside kicks. Even so, I mean, this one will be awfully hard to lose. Kevin Green has to be excellent right now because he's just touching people when they're falling over. I was hoping for anyone but Reed. He just missed. Jim Kelly just missed in the playoffs. I don't even know if... That's going to happen once a game, so. That was our chance. It happened twice. I can't believe it. Honestly, can't. I think it's completed. Unreal that we've got that lucky there. In fact, it turned into a screen pass and a big blitz. Come on. Overshot by a mile, but Jeff Graham's making him look good. Neil Donald's playing as bad right now as he actually always did in the playoffs for Steelers. Phil and qu quotes Chris Hansen makes Neil O'Donnell have a seat. Just throw. I'm okay at that being intercepted. Oh my gosh, he caught it. I just didn't want O'Donnell to take another shot. I might joke about Mike Tom's act not possibly being worse, but I can't really prove that statistically. Yeah, rather not have Stone take another tackle. That's all I'm thinking here. So that was a play designed, designed to keep Dwight Stone healthy. That's why we took those three points. Instead of trying to run out more time, which, you know, I thought of. Blue 48! Blue 48! Put, 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 put. Round 
Here's the bomb. There's another fumble from Kelly this time. They get about as lucky as you'd expect them to ordinarily do. They pick it up, but it's a little too late here. It's 4th and 12. He'll have... Yeah, I think he made that. First down! By about an inch. Good thing about getting in there fast. <laughs> the flying Carnell Lake. This is good though for making him take four down to get ten yards. This will be good in a one-score game. <laughs> Excuse me. Forty-nine seconds to the Super Bowl here. Just throw it away. Totally fine if he gets picked at this point, but a sack is not. I don't think he can get injured on a pressure. I know he can get injured on a sack. Round 52. Hut. Hut. Oh. This pro bowler Kelso. Bills get one more play to Blue, score four hut, touchdowns, hut, and knowing them, hut. they probably will. They called the bomb play there, defense, but first down. All right. And even when the breaks stop coming our way, we still technically outplayed them by a score of three to nothing. Um, yeah, making the most of our opportunities. Donald looks like he has a worse stat line. He does. There's two picks. One of them was bad. One of them was just, you know what? Don't take a sack here. I just thought that guy in the center did look like Bill Cowher. Go for Super Bowl. Find out our opponent here. 49ers and the Cowboys in the playoffs, just like the god of the 90s intended it. And Dallas is still just a uh, machine, unstoppable. So, one of the two teams to beat us. And get to see him one more time here in the Super Bowl. It will be Dallas and Pittsburgh in the Super Bowl. That's happened three times throughout history. This would have been, I guess, number three, but this would be number four for our, us in our timeline, I guess. What the Cowboys did. 31-7, 35-17. Steelers beating the Chiefs, and then really looking like they smacked around the Bills, but of course we know how that one really went. As in the next game, we go for Super Bowl. And again, maybe we should play the Pro Bowl next.
bathroom's in bad condition. Yeah, this may be the move actually, so. Alright, on that note, this is it. Next time around, we'll do the Pro Bowl, um, just to make sure we have those stats all kind of still in there for us to uh, take us to the Super Bowl. Thank you very much, and happy holidays to you and yours.